dear students we are going to discuss the past year neat exam questions now see this one is the question from electric charge and fields the question is the electric intensity due to a dipole of length 10 cm and having a charge of 500 microcoulomb at a point on the axis at a distance 20 cm from one of the charge in air is how much? A. 6.25 into 10 raised to 7 Newton per coulomb. B. 9.28 into 10 raised to 7 Newton per coulomb. C. 13.1 into 10, 10 raised to 11 Newton per coulomb. 20.5 into 10 raised to 7 Newton per coulomb. Yaha pe thoda rectify kar lena aap. ये क्वेश्चन नीट 2001 में पूछा गया था। नाउ रीड अगेन द क्वेश्चन। द इलेक्ट्रिक इंटेंसिटी दैट वी वांट टू फाइंड हमें इलेक्ट्रिक इंटेंसिटी डायपोल के लिए फाइंड आउट करना है। अभी डायपोल की लेंथ 10 सेंटीमीटर दी हुई है एंड चार्ज ऑफ़ द डायपोल 500 माइक्रो कूलम एंड वी वांट ट� on the axis of the dipole at a distance 20 cm from one of the charge. So, now we have a situation. This dipole length is 10 cm. And here we consider the point on the axis of the dipole at a 20 cm from this positive charge. So, this means that this point is where we have इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड इंटेंसिटी फाइंड आउट करनी है वो डायपोल के सेंटर से 25 सेंटीमीटर दूर हो गया मींस वी हैव टू फाइंड द इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड इंटेंसिटी एट अ पॉइंट 25 सेंटीमीटर ऑन द एक्सिस ऑफ द डायपोल अब क्वेश्चन ये हो गया सो वी हैव द इक्वेशन फॉर द इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड इंटेंसिटी एट एनी पॉइंट ऑन द एक्सिस ऑफ द डायपोल दैट इज E equal to K 2 P R upon R square minus A square whole square. यहाँ पे P हम calculate कर सकते हैं Q into 2 A. Q charge हमें दिया हुआ है 500 micro coulomb. So 500 into 10 is to minus 6 2 A. That is the distance between two charges and that is 10 centimeter. So 10 into 10 is to minus 2 meter. So our dipole moment P, that will be 5 into 10 raised to minus 5 coulomb meter. Abhi, distance of the point R that is 25 centimeter, jaha hum electric field intensity find out karna chahte hain. So that is 0.25 meter. A, that is 5 centimeter, so 0 0.05 meter. Now substitute all these values in this equation of electric field. So, now all these values we have kept, solve it, so the answer will come. 6.25 into 10 raised to 7 Newton per coulomb. That means that our answer has become A. Clear, children? Now, thank you for watching the video.